have it. It's been one week since you looked at me. Got your hand up inside and said I'm angry. Five days since you laughed at me. Saying get back together, come back and see me. Three days to living room. I realized it's all my fault, but couldn't tell you. Yesterday, you've forgiven me. But it'll still be two days till I say I'm sorry. Hope it now will watch the hood wink. Does it make you stop think? You'll think you're looking at Aquaman. I summon fish to the dish, although I like Thank the shallot sweets. I like the sushi because it's never touch a frying pan. Hot like wasabi when I bust rhymes. Speak like Leanne rhymes because I'm all about value. Bird campers got the mad hits. You try to match wits. You try to hold me, but I bust through. Gonna make a break and take a pick. I like a sink and make a shake. I like vanilla. It's the finest of the flavors. Gonna see the show because then you'll know the vertigo is gonna go because it's so dangerous. You'll have to sign a waiver. I can't help it if I think you're funny when you're mad. Trying hard not to smile, though I feel bad. I'm the kind of guy who laughs at a funeral. Can't understand what I mean while you're sitting well. I have a tendency to wear my mind on my sleeve. I have a history of taking off my shirt. It's been one week since you looked at me. Threw your ass in the air and said you're crazy. Five days since you tackled me. I still got the reference on both my knees. It's been three days since the afternoon. You realize it's not my fault, but I won't too soon. Yesterday you'd forgiven me. And now I'll sit back and wait till you say you're sorry. Drumstick and your brain stops sticking. Watching X Files with no lights on. With all our masons. I hope the smoking man's in this. While like Harrison Ford, I'm getting frantic. Like Sting, I'm tantric. Like Sting, who's guaranteed to satisfy. Like Kurosawa, I make mad films. Okay, I don't make films. But if I did, they'd have a samurai. Can you get a set of better clubs? Can I find the kind with tiny numbers on my arms? I'm always flying off the back swing. Can you get into my sailor mood? Cause that cartoon has got the boom and I made babes that make me think the wrong thing. How can I help it if I think you're funny when you're mad? Trying hard not to smile, but I feel bad. I'm the kind of guy who laughs at a funeral. It's been one week since you looked at me. Dropped your ass the sides and said I'm sorry. Five days since I laughed. And welcome to Bobby Lycus Car Clinic. Glad to have you join me today here on paltalk.com. Every Thursday, if you would just tick your calendars and hang around for this hour, and what I'll do is I'll share with you information about why plug-in cars. I mean, are plug-in cars coming? Absolutely, they're on the way. That means that you're zero emissions. Nissan, Nissan has a new eco pedal. I'll tell you about that. It's a gas pedal that pushes back if you, if you exceed a certain speed. I'm not sure you're going to like that at all. The good news is you can, as I understand, turn it off. Also, 09 Lincoln, the Cadillac CTS, and the Lincoln MKS are engineered to run just as well on regular fuel as premium fuel. And you know, you think they've changed those cars? I'll tell you a little bit later on in the program, if they indeed have. Also, a little later in the program, we're going to have with us the president of the Alliance to Save Energy in Washington, D.C., and that's a Kateri Callahan, and she's going to share with us some tips and information that you'll enjoy hearing because it's all about how what can impact you and your life with regard to MPG. If you'd like to chime in, feel free to do so. You know the drill. This is a G-rated room. Please keep it that way, please. Uh, if you have a car question or if you maybe maybe your car you've been told you need to spend fifteen hundred or two thousand dollars on your automobile or five hundred and you're faced with a decision do I make that decision do I bite that bullet or do I bite a larger bullet a bigger bullet and trade it in and speaking of trade-ins if, if folks if you're driving an SUV or a, a pickup truck or an automobile that gets MPG somewhere in the teens I'm talking 13 to 19 miles per gallon. Well, hopefully the 19's for you. But if you're in that 15 mile per gallon range, like most Ford F-150s, it's best that you hang on to that vehicle. And I will tell you and share with you some solid upgrades that you can do without breaking your bank, without breaking your wallet, that will increase your MPG. That will, and the increase in MPG will offset the expense that and that you spend and it will increase uh, the oil change interval. And I'll, I'll start off with that because that seems to be a, a real 
misunderstood perception, and that is when should you change oil? Should you use synthetic oil? Is synthetic better? Absolutely. Uh, and, and how long can you drive on synthetic oil? So I'm going to share with you that 5,000-mile oil changes are best. You can use 5,000-mile oil changes are best. You can use, if you use a, a quality-grade oil, I, I chose Royal Purple, and there's a ton of information on Royal Purple's site, and you can go there, royalpurple.com. Uh, if you choose and you want more information, uh, but don't don't leave this room for right now because I'm going to be sharing with you this information. As I said, uh, you, you can go 10,000 miles on synthetic oil, but you have to change the filter every 5,000 miles. So, what are your options? Your options are number one, you need to know first, right off the bat, that if you're paying $20 for an oil change at a fast in, fast out lube center. It's somewhere along the line, unless they're selling you some additional upsell, it's called upsell, and you know the drug.